Our Drevit models can be difficult to understand and manage, but not with ID8 Explorer. ID8 Explorer has an easy to use and intuitive user interface that gives you many tools to display, sort, filter, search, query, review Revit warnings, and fully understand the complex relationships of your Revit model. These 10 tips are designed for everyone that uses Revit, but are especially important for BIM managers or project managers. We have come up with this list of 10 ways to incorporate the use of ID8 Explorer in your Revit quality control processes. ID8 Explorer scans the model for accurate element counts and reports the aggregate number of elements, not only in the current view, but in the entire project as well. Revit filters can be used to narrow down what you are looking for. This is a little bit like taking your model's blood pressure. It's a very basic indicator of the Revit model health. By default, ID8 Explorer will display the results based on the element category. After noting the element count, take a moment to scan the element list, pausing to review any category that seems particularly low or high. Double click to zoom to any specific element. Selecting on the checkbox will highlight the element within the Revit canvas and place it into Revit's selection set to allow for further modification. ID8 Explorer contains a built-in filter called ID8 Audit. By selecting this filter, the results tree will show you categories that you should pay close attention to review. Excessive numbers of detail lines can be an indication of an exploded AutoCAD import, in particular, exploded AutoCAD details. Model lines are visible in the 3D views, and in general, the use of model lines should be limited. ID8 Explorer enables us to identify an excessive use of model or detail lines, which can cause model issues like bloated file size, visibility, or plotting issues. When auditing your model's line elements, look closely at the usage and quantity of both detail and model lines, but also take the time to scan for valid naming conventions. Non-standard names can be selected with ID8 Explorer and then reassigned to a company standard. Scan your project for non-standard text and dimension styles. An excessive amount of non-standard text definitions is a symptom of imported and exploded AutoCAD files or the result of copying and pasting a text objects from different projects with the same name but different parameter values. A quick scan of the text styles used in this model demonstrates how out of control this has become. These duplicate versions of the Arial style, for example, need to be removed. Use ID8 Explorer to select any of the non-standard text styles and swap them out for approved styles. You could even use ID8 Query to check for dimensions that may have been overridden. If this is not an acceptable practice for your firm, you can use ID8 Query to find the overridden dimension and set it back to the correct display. Audit Revision Sequences Reviewing revisions are important from a project liability standpoint. ID8 Explorer provides a quick way of reviewing these project elements. The expanded list of revision clouds is organized by revision sequence. As the BIM manager, you need to ensure that each revision has been properly placed and noted. With ID8 Explorer, you can review each instance by double-clicking to open each view. You can select a detail view to look at the information in more detail. Notice how each revision indicates its appropriate view or sheet through the worksite assignment. You can also generate an Excel list of these revisions by selecting the Export command on the Detail View dialog. An audit of these elements ensures that they are being properly utilized and this will eliminate downstream liability issues with misplaced or misused revisions. You can use ID8 Explorer to audit Revit families too. Good health starts with a lean template and clean families, particularly your Revit title block. All the same auditing tools that are useful and important in the project environment are all available for use in the Revit family editor environment. Select on the family you would like to review. ID8 Explorer will change to display elements of the family that we just opened. You can isolate or explore elements to ensure they were constructed properly and they don't have information that is unnecessary that will bloat the Revit model. You can also use ID8 Query to audit all the families in a project and understand where the in-place families have been used. In-place families can increase model size and degrade the performance. Multiple in-place families may signal that a component family would have been a better and more efficient solution. ID8 Explorer gives you access to views and viewports. In addition, ID8 Explorer provides you with access to view references, which are markers such as cameras and detail callouts that reference a view. Use the Navigate tab to review legends, schedules, sheets, and views. 
review views that have been placed on a sheet, and you can open either the view or the sheet that contains that specific view. Reviewing view references provides BIM managers or project managers access to another important auditing tool. Use ID8 Explorer to scan for view references and zoom to any reference location for further analysis. Being able to see 3D view references such as cameras will allow you to purge unwanted views and keep your models performing well. Grids, levels, and reference planes are the backbone of a good building information model. We can organize the Revit project by changing the sort by to level. Here we see that a door is on the top of footing level, which seems to be incorrect. We can select on the door and isolate it within the 3D view to review. We can quickly see that the door needs to be changed to the first floor. Reference planes and grids are also important to audit. Use ID8 Explorer to review the naming for each to keep your projects clean. Grids, levels, and reference planes are part of the datum elements, and they are used to construct major system families such as floors and roofs, as well as locate structural elements such as columns and foundations. However, sometimes grids and levels can play a little trick. When a grid or level is poorly constructed, it may be hard to find inside the Revit project. ID8 Explorer enables us to select those difficult to find grids and levels and then restore the visibility if needed. Audit your Revit work sets. As an example, elements on the wrong work set can impact display settings, plotting, and project performance. You can use ID8 Explorer in combination with the Revit work sharing display mode to see both color and the ID8 Explorer results tree view. We can change the sort by option to work set. A quick audit of the work sets shows that several elements have been misplaced on the wrong work set. This could easily cause plotting errors. We can move these doors from the furniture work set to the shell work set for proper classification. Failure to manage the warnings in your Revit project could result in poor performance, slow synchronization times, incorrect schedule data, or even file corruption. In your Revit model, you have numerous unresolved warnings and want to understand if some are more critical than others. Can some be ignored? Are others more likely to cause performance issues and therefore should be assigned a higher priority? ID8 Explorer includes the ID8 Warnings Manager that allows you to easily review and fix warnings. CAD imports are still considered by many one of the top causes of performance decline in a Revit project. CAD imports can bloat the model size and bring with them a wide array of non-standard conversion settings that includes imported line styles, filled regions, patterns, and color overrides. Here, we can see two instances of the same CAD import. Double-clicking on the first instance opens the proper view. However, double-clicking on the second instance indicates that the CAD import has been hidden. ID8 Explorer will turn on Reveal Hidden Elements mode to review the CAD import. Clearly, this is a mistake, so we can use ID8 Delete to remove the unwanted CAD import from our model. We've just covered 10 important auditing tips in less than 10 minutes. Think of these tips as the ounce of prevention to avoid headaches and wasted time spent troubleshooting problematic Revit models. Use ID8 Explorer to audit your Revit models on a daily or weekly basis to keep your Revit models in Olympic-worthy shape. For more information on all of our Revit-based applications, including trial downloads, software updates, product help, and blog posts, be sure to visit our website at www.id8software.com. Additionally, be sure to follow us on all of our social media channels as we continue to publish helpful information on all of our products. From the entire ID8 software team, thank you so much for reviewing this video.